Hello guys welcome back to the channel i hope you are doing extremely fine my name is prince and you are watching the tech stream in this video i am going to share with you some of the best features of color os 13 on my oneplus 8t so without wasting any more time let's get started so this is the closed beta version of color os 13 which has been released for the oneplus 8 series and if i go into the about info section you can see that the color os version is an alpha version and the build number is f.03 for all oneplus 8 8 pro and 8t i have already made a complete review on this build feel free to check that video out if you are considering to install this build now let's talk about some of the features of color os 13 one of the new addition in color os 13 is the new and gorgeous widgets we have got a lot of new widgets but on this closed version not all of them are available but we do have some widgets like photo widget weather widget contact calendar app usage and battery widget also all these widgets look very appealing and follow and consistent card like design theme the animation on the widgets also look very premium next up we have the new glance feature on the left which is like a one plus self feature it holds all the important widgets for you like weather step tracker delivery information notes etc you can also add or remove widgets here and these look so premium just have a look at the design of these just look so clean another feature added on the home screen of color os 13 is the option to enlarge a folder by enlarging a folder you can access all the apps in the folder directly from the outside without opening the folder and if you want to access other apps of the folder you can also swipe right on it definitely a great addition as it gives your device a new look apart from the regular i can along with adding some functionality to it and you can do all the stuff without opening the folder next up we have a big design overhaul in the qs panel where now we have two new big qs tiles on the top left for easier accessibility by default it is just set to wifi and bluetooth which are the most used tiles also and on the right we have the music player widget which will help you to play music on the go and if you click on this widget you can see other info about music being played apart from the music widget tile you can edit all the other tiles from the settings the new qs tile look very good and refreshing to me another great and i think the most underrated feature is the improved layout of the landscape mode now in the landscape mode when you pull the notification shade down you get all your qs tiles on the left and the notification panel on the right it is such an amazing feature as earlier it was very very difficult to access notifications in the landscape mode but now this looks very good apart from that you can also have the theme icons for third party apps now earlier it was just the google apps only but currently not all apps support this feature as android 13 is just rolling out hopefully all apps will start using this feature very soon and it will make themed icons look very very good and last but not the least we have the new contextual menu which adds a new design and more info on the lock screen apart from this color os 13 has added two new widgets the first one being a spotify widget and other one being a status update for the food delivery app so it does add some useful info on the always on display and you can do a lot of things without opening the device kudos to the color os team for adding such useful features that's it for this video those were the top 7 features of android 13 in my opinion comment down which feature you like the most subscribe to the channel for more tech videos thank you for watching